Hey guys, what's up? So here I have an HP EliteBook 8460p. So this laptop is a laptop that was manufactured in 2011. This was HP's business line of laptops. So this was um, a very solidly built machine at, at the time and still is today. This competed against the Lenovo ThinkPad T420, the Dell Latitude E6420, and a few others that I cannot name right now. Um, the condition of this thing is just absolutely fabulous for a computer that's 10 years old. Uh, there's like not a single scratch on there. And as you can see, the interior of the laptop, the keyboard is just super clean. There's no wear marks on there. The trackpad is really clean. Um, as a matter of fact, very clean. The Windows 7 and Core i5 badges are still there. Um, the palm rest is just extremely clean. Um, even like the edges of the laptop is just flawless. And what's amazing is that the battery still works. This is the original battery, mind you. Um, so uh, this laptop has eight gigs of RAM a 120 gig Samsung solid state drive. Uh, like I mentioned, Sandy Bridge Core i5 processor. Um, and for a laptop um, today, um, it's still very usable, um, extremely usable actually. I managed to install Windows 11 on this machine. So let's take a look here. Um, so what I'm going to do actually is, um, I'm going to perform a, a full reboot of the machine. Let's see here. Do a complete restart. I mean, it's a very solidly built machine. Uh, if you're looking for a laptop, um, that's not a Chromebook. Um, but you're looking to pay about less than $200, I would choose this. And there we go. It's fully booted up. Um, this laptop is still, you know, holds its own even today. Um, I still hear a lot of people still use a laptop like this. And uh, it's, it's well, well built. Um, and it has all the features that you would need. Yes, it doesn't have USB type C, but that's okay. Um, for the basic average user, I think this is plenty. So um, if you guys have any questions or comments, uh, feel free to leave them down below. Thank you guys for watching and uh, you know, have any questions, just uh, feel free to ask. Thanks.